Hey guys, Method Saying 90 here. Today is Wednesday, August 16th. Hope you guys are having a good day today. So far, I'm having a good day. Yeah. And guess what, guys? I'm on a bike ride right now. Hey, look at that. I'm on a bike ride right now. And you can probably tell I'm at a Tecumseh Park. Yeah. I actually went for a pretty long bike ride today, you guys. In fact, I actually rode out all the way to like where the McDonald's and the K2 Mart gas station is on Bluefield near the 401. Yeah, I rode all the way out there today. And then I went down uh, 8th Line to Queen Street. Then I went up Queen Street all the way back into town. And I went past the VS station, got up William Street, went down King Street, and went through downtown for a little bit. And now I ended up here. I actually went for a pretty long bike ride today, you guys. In fact, I actually haven't been all the way out to like Bloomfield or like like that area like since June. Wow. Yeah. It was a good ride though. Yeah, I've been out for like maybe two and a half hours, almost three hours now. It's not too bad. Uh, actually, I'm going to be uh, posting a picture of my bike route. I'm going to be going on Google Maps and I'm going to be like drawing out like my whole route. And I'll be posting on my you know Facebook and Instagram and all that so you guys will be able to see it on my Instagram. Uh, I know I told you guys that I probably wasn't going to do a video today and that I was going to do a video on Thursday, which is tomorrow. But I was like, well, since I'm off for a bike ride, I guess I will might as well do a vlog today. Might as well, right? Um, so yeah. So since I'm gonna be doing a since I'm doing a vlog today, uh, next time I'll probably do a vlog will be on Friday. So yeah, next time I'll vlog will probably be Friday. Um, and I hope you guys enjoyed the video I made yesterday. Uh, yesterday I just wanted to make like a short video just to talk about how cool it was in Chatham yesterday because yesterday actually was a little cool out in Chatham. Well, yesterday it was like 21, but it was like pretty windy, so it kind of felt a little cooler. But when I was out walking later yesterday night, and that's when I was vlogging. It actually got like a little cooler. It like, got down to like 17 last night. So that's probably why in yesterday's vlog, if you guys seen it, you guys all know I was like wearing my sweater and like my pants and all that. But today I'm wearing t-shirt and shorts because it's a lot warmer today. Uh, in fact, you can probably tell it's pretty sunny outside and it is pretty warm outside. Like I think it's like, I think it's like 24 outside right now. So it's actually not bad. Um, and I, it actually is a little hot outside. Like I'm actually a little sweaty, but you know, it's okay. Yeah, it's like 24 degrees today, but it kind of feels a little hotter outside because like while I was out biking, like the sun was just beaming down. There wasn't really a lot of breeze. I was like, damn, it's hot. Yeah. But it's not too bad. It's like 24, so it's not crazy hot. Yeah. It's not really too busy at the park right now. There's like some people here and they are working on uh, like, you know, William Street over there. But yeah. And I'm just staying by the, you know, bathrooms and all that. I figure it's like a nice spot to do a vlog and plus you know whenever I do a bike ride vlog usually I vlog here because it's like a nice good spot nice quiet area you know more shade right so yeah um but yeah I had a pretty good bike ride today yeah I don't know I, I, I was thinking about it and I was like huh I guess I'll go for a bike ride today why not it's supposed to be pretty nice today so I figured I'd just go for a bike ride and I actually went for a pretty big bike ride hey um I'm probably going to be going home after this because I've been out riding for like a long time now and I want to go home and relax for a little bit and have dinner. I might even take a shower when I get home because I'm actually like a little sweaty, like a little, you know, sweaty, you know, sweaty and, you know, all that clampy. So I figure I'll just go home, take a shower and get all get the sweat, get the sweat off me and yeah, have dinner because I'm actually going to be getting hungry soon. So, yeah. Um... But yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy yesterday's video. If you guys haven't seen that video, the link to that will be down below. And if you guys also yet haven't seen Monday's vlog, the link to that will also be down below as well. Um, like I said, the next time I'll do a vlog, guys, will probably be on Friday, the 18th. So, yeah. Um, but yeah, um, it actually feels like this week's going by pretty quick, though. Like, I'm not going to lie. It kind of does. Yeah. We're already halfway to the weekend. Like, in a couple days, it's going to be Friday already. Like, damn, that's crazy. Uh, I might see if Dustin wants to hang out on Friday, so when I do a vlog on Friday, you guys might see Dustin in the vlog. Uh, maybe on Friday, if we, if me and Dustin hang out Friday, uh, maybe we can hang out with them all again, and maybe this time I can actually film some of it for you guys. And maybe, if, maybe if it's nice out that day, we could also walk around for a little bit, and then maybe we could go back to my house if he wants to, so, yeah. And since I have, and actually guys, uh, the last time, uh, Dustin came over to my house, I actually got, uh, a PS Pen, uh, membership for like a whole month where I'm actually able to play GTA Online for a whole month. Uh, it's only for a month though, like it, it's like exactly a month. I got it on the 11th, which was five days ago. So that means uh, I'll have, I'll be able to play GTA Online until September 11th. Now, 
on that day, uh, you'll have an option if you want to like buy another membership where you can do for like another whole month and then, you know, but you could also say no, like you don't want to pay another one. You can just not pay and all that. So, yeah, I don't know. I'm kind of thinking that maybe I can do another month and then have until like October 11th or I could just not, you know, do the uh, GT online. I can just cancel it on September 11th and all that. So, yeah. I mean, it wasn't too bad. I think it was like $13 and something cents. It wasn't too bad, actually. But, yeah, it's not too expensive for a whole month. Yeah. Um, so, yeah. Um, but, yeah, it's not too bad around here. I know I said that already, but, yeah. I'm trying to think of something to say. Oh, yeah, guys. Um, okay, so I actually had this idea earlier. Before I left my house, I was, I was you know, playing around on Google Maps and, like, all that stuff. But... I thought about it and I was like, you guys know, okay, do you guys know where that old train track is that goes like from Grand Avenue that goes all the way up to like McNaughton and like TJ Staples and all that stuff, like that abandoned train track? It's the same train track that goes down like the Black Bridge area way. Well, I was thinking, what if they rip up that old track from like Grand Ave to like, I don't know, McNaughton or whatever. They rip up that old track and what if they turn it into like a bike and walking pathway? I think that'd be really cool because like, you know, those old tracks have sat empty for many years and, you know, the council has not done anything about it. Originally, they were wanting to start up our own local, like, rail line from, like, Chatham to, like, I think Wallaceburg, but they never did it or anything. I think they had the idea in, like, 2014, I think. So, I, th I don't know, I'm roughly guessing, but, yeah. They didn't do it, and so now th these those tracks have just sat empty, like, probably for a long time. They're going to be sat empty like that for a while. So I was thinking, what if they ripped up the old tracks, like of the Black Bridge way, like maybe they start maybe at the Black Bridge, or they just start at Grand Ave, and then they go all the way out to like McNaughton Ave or TJ Staples, and they turn into like a bike walking pathway. I think that'd be pretty cool. I did kind of sketch a picture of it um, on Microsoft Paint. I'll put a picture of it like right here. This is what I'm talking about. Like, see, like you got like a map. This is from Google Maps. But you see like that little red line I drew over there? You see that little red line? Yeah, that's the that's the where I was thinking they could put like a pathway like along that old track there. It starts actually as a given road and then it'll go all the way down to like Grand Ave. Yeah, I decided like what if they made like a little pathway in that area? I think actually would be pretty cool. What do you guys think? Do you guys think they should build a, a pathway all on the old track there? Let me know in the comments below if you guys agree. Because I think that'd be pretty cool. Yeah, it'd be like a new pathway and it'd be something to check out. Like, maybe they can start at, like, TJ State Bowls, or they can start at, like, McNaughton area, like, in that area, and they can end it off at, like, Grand Ave, or continue it at the Black Bridge, and then, you know, they could end it off, like, maybe, like, at the, you know, at that one street near the retirement home or whatever. Maybe they can do that or something, but, yeah. Um, I don't know, I think that'd be pretty cool. Yeah. Actually, I'm gonna get a thumbnail for you guys. There you go. Um, but yeah, I'm not sure what I'm going to be doing this weekend, like if I have anything big planned this weekend, you guys all know what I'm probably going to be doing like on the weekend nights, but so far, I'm, so far I know that for Friday I'm going to be probably hanging out with Dustin and all that, but for Saturday and Sunday I don't even know what I'm going to be doing, so yeah, that's okay, I'll figure it out, um, yeah, but uh, I'm going to pause the video for now guys. And uh, I'm actually going to continue vlogging when I'm at the train station, maybe. And uh, then I'll probably end the vlog there. I just want to vlog here for a little bit. So I'll pause it. I'll catch you guys at the VS station. Okay, guys. So now I'm at the VS station. Uh, yeah, I just left to come see Park. And I just got here, like, literally a few minutes ago. Uh, like I said, I'm actually heading home right now because I'm going to take a shower and I'm going to have dinner and all that. Relax in my house for a little while. And then probably later, or like, maybe around 8 o'clock-ish, I'll go back out and walk around. Yeah. Uh, <clears throat> so yeah, um, I had a good day today, good day riding my bike and all that. Um, I'm not sure what I'm going to be doing tomorrow, I might just walk around tomorrow probably, so I'll probably do, be doing that, and, um, and then on Friday, you know, like I said, I might see if Dustin wants to hang out, and if we do, yeah, then we might maybe see if he wants to meet up at the mall, and we could hang out at the mall, and maybe it might film for you guys, maybe, uh -huh. and then maybe we'll, uh, walk around maybe and maybe go back to my house yeah we'll see we'll see you on friday yeah um actually guys did you know that since it is august 16th 
Did you know that we're actually now in the very middle of August? Yeah, now we're in the very middle of August because 15 days ago was actually August 1st, the first day of August. And 15 days, 15 days from now will be the 31st, the last day of August. So that means, that means today we're exactly halfway through August now. Wow, because yeah, 15 days ago was the first day of August and 15 days from now will be the last day of August. Wow. Well, I actually can't believe that we're already halfway through August now. Exactly halfway through. Like, we're already, ha we're already halfway till September. Like, we're already, like, done the first half of August. And now we just got the rest of August to go. And then it'll be September. Like, Jesus. I actually just can't believe that we're already, like, in the very middle of August. Like, that is crazy. Wow. Yeah. Can you guys believe that? That's already the middle of August. Like, exactly in the middle. <laughs> That's crazy. Like, Jesus. Like, I just realized that. I was like, hold up. Wait a minute. We are in the very middle of August now. Wow. Yeah. That's just crazy. Um, yeah. Well. Uh, so, what I was thinking, guys, is maybe I won't end the vlog after this. Uh, maybe I'll pause it after I'm done filming this, and maybe I'll vlog one more time when I'm out walking. And then maybe I'll end the vlog. Um, because I was thinking, like, at the park, I was like, well. Maybe when I film at the train station, maybe I can just pause it after. Or maybe I can vlog one more time when I'm walking around, like, later today when it gets darker out. And then I can talk about a few more things while I'm out walking, and then I'll end the vlog. So maybe I'll do that for you guys. Um, yeah. That's what I was thinking. Um, and there's no trains coming at the VS station right now. It is, like, 4. Like, actually, it's, like, almost 5 o'clock now. So it's not going to be any trains coming for a little while. I think the next VIA train's at like 6.30, so we got like another hour and a half before another train comes. So, yeah, it's okay. Um, it actually was a little bit down busy. <laughs> it actually was a little bit busy downtown, is what I was trying to say. Yeah, it was, it was a little bit busy downtown, like a little bit. Not crazy busy, though, so, I mean, that's okay. Like I said, there wasn't really that much people at the park, but there was still a good amount of people. Yeah, still a good number of it. And, um... I actually just posted a picture on my bike route, so if you guys go on my Instagram story, I posted on my story, so if you guys go on my Instagram story, you guys will see uh, my bike route and how long, how far I went. You guys will be like, wow, he went for a big ride. Sure did. <laughs> yup. <laughs> yeah. I even posted it on my Snapchat, so if you guys have me on Snapchat, you guys will see it too and stuff like that. So, yeah, not bad. Um, yeah. But, um... Alright guys, I'm going to pause it again, and uh, next time I'll vlog, I'll vlog one more time when I'm walking around later. So I'll pause it, and I'll catch you guys later. Okay guys, I'm back now, and you can probably tell I'm walking now. Uh, I'm actually downtown on Wellington Street, and there's St. Joe's Church right there. And there's the Spirit and Life Center. Hey. Um, yeah guys, I'm just out walking now. Uh, I think it's like almost 9.30 right now, so you know, now you can probably tell it's getting to nighttime now. And it's still not too bad outside. It's a little nicer now. It's not as hot. Um, I think right now it's like 21 degrees right now. So it's actually not bad. It's like not hot anymore. It's still pretty warm, but you know, it's not hot. It's definitely a lot warmer than last night. Like last night it was like pretty chilly, but tonight it's like, it's warm, but it's not like hot. It's like 21. You know, still like shorts and t-shirt weather. So yeah, not bad. And I went to Tammy's and got myself a large de or medium decaf double-double. I'm so used to saying large decaf double double because that's what I usually get, but lately I've just been getting mediums from Timmy's, so yeah. And no, I didn't get it from the Timmy's over here on 3rd Street, I got it at the one on Park Ave. So, yeah. There's the LCBO right here, and there's back of the Capitol Theater over there. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to take a little detour, take a different way tonight. Normally I would just go down King Street and then go up the 3rd Street Bridge, but I figured I'd just take a little detour down Wellington Street and... And I'll go up 3rd Street and cross the 3rd Street Bridge and then I'll go down Grand Ave and uh, yeah. Yeah, it's not really too busy downtown. Yeah, it's not busy tonight. It's not really a lot of people down here. It's like a good amount of people though, but it's not like really busy. Probably like Friday and Saturday is going to be like the busiest days because it won't be the weekend. But yeah, but I think for like tonight, tomorrow and Sunday it's not going to be busy at all. And even like Monday and Tuesday, it's not going to be busy at all. Yeah. We're actually about to pass the 3rd Street Timmy's right here. Yeah, they're not open right now because they closed. They, those Timmy's actually... Wait. Is it open? 
Nope, it's closed. Yeah, see? There's no one in there. Not even staff in there. Yeah, I think this is the Timmy's that closes like the earliest compared to all the other Timmy's in Chatham. I think this is the only Timmy's in town that has like the earliest hours. But then again, this is the downtown Tim Hortons, so, you know, maybe it might close a little earlier because, you know, if they were to open it like till like 10 or 11, let's say, then, you know, they probably had a lot of like crackheads go there at like nighttime and it would just not be good. So that's probably why they close at like 9, like a little earlier time, just so like, you know, they don't have to worry about that too much. So, I mean, hey, it's okay. But then again, like all the other Timmy's in Chatham, I know, like they open until like 10 or 11, so, yeah. Well, the one on 3rd Street, like I said, is like closing to nine, so it's okay. There's the police station right here, which some other people also call it the cop shop. <laughs> yeah, it's the police station. And this is actually the side of the jazz bar. There's like a door you can go to it. Not bad. Um, I'm actually going to cross the street here and then cross on to the other side. So I can go up the street bridge here because that's the side I'm going to go on. Actually, the light's green, so I'm going to see if I can quickly cross. There I go. I'm going to cross the street and then I'll cross over here. And I'll go on the bridge on that side. Hey, perfect timing. Lights just turned yellow and that light's about to turn green. Perfect. There we go. But yeah, like I said, it's not too bad around here. Yeah, it's not really busy downtown. There's a truck over at the, the bank there, like the security bank truck at the bank right now. So yeah, we're just gonna go up the Thurston Bridge, you guys, and uh, we're gonna go, uh, either I might go past down 11 or we'll go down Emma Street by the hospital and then across and then go down Grand. Or maybe I'll just walk by UCC, but yeah. I'll walk by UCC, then I'll go down Grand and then Kyle and all that. So I'll probably do that, you know, my usual route. Um, and I hope you guys have a good day tomorrow. Uh, I'm probably not going to do much tomorrow. Maybe I'll just walk around and all that. I might have to even do some things at home tomorrow, like chores. So, yeah, I'll probably be doing like a chore day tomorrow at my house. And then maybe I'll see if Dustin wants to hang out on Friday. In fact, I heard they're calling for some rain tomorrow. So, I mean, hey, even if it does rain tomorrow, it'd be perfect for me to like do some chores at home. So, yeah, it'd be kind of perfect, actually. But yeah, then like I said, I might see if Dustin wants to hang out on Friday. Uh, we might hang out at the mall. And maybe we might walk around and maybe we'll go back to my house later on. Then I'll walk Dustin home later on Friday. So if, if we do all that, I'll let you guys know. And I might even shave my beard too because my beard is honestly getting long again. Not that I want my beard, but it's like I would rather have my beard when it's like colder outside just so it keeps my face warm. <laughs> well, I mean, then again, because you, it's you know summertime and it's still hot outside. It's still summer, it still gets pretty hot outside, so I'm like, I should probably, you know, keep the keep the face clean until, like, the fall, like, maybe, like, until, like, October, and then I can start growing my beard out again, like, October, you know? Or even, like, September, if it gets cold enough, but hopefully it doesn't get cold in, like, September or October. Hopefully it doesn't get cold right away. Because I remember last year, at the beginning of fall, if you guys remember, it got cold out in Chatham, like, immediately. Like, as soon as fall started in, in like, September. I was like, wow, like, why is it already cold? It's like the end of September. It's like, it's not, it's not, it doesn't get that cold yet. But then again, there have been times in previous years where it's gotten cold, where it's gotten cold in like September. I remember when in the beginning of fall, back in like 2019, it would got cold out immediately. Like, like I remember the beginning of fall in 2019, it got chilly out immediately. I remember September of 2020, like some days were actually like pretty chilly. Uh, September of 2021 was actually really warm still, like it actually wasn't like that cold at all. Um, well, there were some days that were cold, like the first day of fall was pretty chilly. Um, and even the second day. Um, actually no, second day of fall was like pretty warm actually. Like the day before and like the, in the first day of fall was pretty chilly. And then, you know, beginning of fall last year in 2022, that was pretty chilly. So I'm hoping that the beginning of fall this year, it won't be chilly right away. Hopefully it will hopefully it'll be chilly out by like, I'm hoping it doesn't get cold out until like, at least after Crowfest in October. But that way we'll still have like, roughly two months of warm weather still. And then like, sometime in the middle of October, like after Crowfest and around Halloween, it can start getting a little chilly out, like fall weather. So, yeah, I'm, hope I'm hoping. Yeah. 
basically what I'm trying to say is I just hope it's still I just hope it stays warm like this at least until like middle of October hopefully but we'll see and we just we actually just passed 7-eleven in Paisano which was right there <laughs> yeah yeah there are a lot of cars driving around tonight there you, if you guys probably have noticed you hear all the cars um, yeah um, all right, guys, you know what? Uh, I'm probably just gonna end the vlog here. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. And if you did, be sure to smash the like button, subscribe to the bell on. Uh, like I said, if you guys want to check out yesterday and Monday's vlog, the link to those videos will be down below. Uh, stay tuned for Friday's vlog. Um, I promise the next vlog will be on Friday because uh, I'm not gonna vlog tomorrow. Actually, I'm probably not gonna vlog. I'll do a vlog on, on Friday and all that, and then maybe the next vlog after that will probably be on Sunday or Monday. We'll see. Uh, be sure to follow me on Instagram, my TikTok. Uh, the links will be down below. Uh, go check out my band's Instagram, my band's TikTok. Uh, the links will be down below as well. And go subscribe to my Railfin channel. The link to that will be down below. Hope you guys have a good rest of your day. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.